I've had two friends in the last week purchase Canva Pro just because of this one feature to help them with YouTube thumbnails. Background remover in Canva is so much better than even in Photoshop. Let me show you how it works. Let's say I'm working on this guide to mindfulness meditation and I wanna put a photo here to the right. Now one of the cool things about Canva Pro is I actually have a huge library of assets. So I could just type in here uh, meditation maybe. And once I type that, I get tons of different, well, not on the templates, we're gonna type on the elements side, we're gonna type meditation, and I get tons of different, some of these Canva Pro elements, some of them free, so if you're using the free version, you get the free elements, but a lot of them are pro. Now I can scroll down through these assets. The simpler the background, the better for something like this, but even something as complex as this background here. Once I have this photo out, I can click on it and go up to edit image. A lot of features in here are free. Some of them do require Canva Pro. The one that requires Canva Pro is the background remover. You can see the little crown next to it. Background remover is amazing. It's a one click feature that allows you to remove the background around your subject in the photo. Canva figures out where your subject is. If it gets it wrong, you can erase or restore with these brushes on the upper left. It'll load for a little bit as it does its number crunching here. And then just like magic, you have your subject cut out. So I could take this photo, resize it a little bit to fit in here. And now all of a sudden, you have the guide to mindfulness with a photo here on the right. The other thing you can do here, which is nice, is back up in edit image. You can actually make a lot of adjustments. So we could bump up the clarity a little bit. We could uh, maybe even, so the opposite of blur would be sharpen. There is no sharpen in here, but blur negatively is sharpen. Obviously that's too much if you go too far, but you could sharpen up just a little bit to try to just maybe make some adjustments to your image. You can add all sorts of filters in here and see how they work. Some of them are Canva Pro features, some of them are not, but the main Canva Pro feature that I think makes Canva Pro completely worth it is the background remover. And even better, you guys can try Canva Pro for free. There's a link in the description or the top comment on this video. Let me know what you think about this feature. I think it works like magic.